Hey guys, what's up? I had a tournament up on the Susquehanna River at Williamsport. Uh, we ended up getting third place. In the morning here, uh, the bite was pretty fast. Uh, we actually landed on a really good spot. We didn't practice for any of this, so it was just kind of for the first hour I wanted to just see what the fish were doing. Um, but I ended up getting pretty lucky that we started around some fish. Um, I didn't have the GoPro running for the first couple catches because uh, it was still dark so I still had the light on the back of my boat. A lot of these fish weren't super shallow like they were sitting right off the edge of something. Um, a lot of times I would uh, pull my jig right off the edge and let it drop and then uh, I would get a bite. Uh, I do want to apologize again with some of these tournaments I just get really focused on what I'm doing and I forget to hold the fish up I think for the most part you guys will be able to see every fish maybe except for one you might not be able to see real well um, but I just really get focused in on these things it's just still something that I have to work on and get better at pretty much though it, uh, as you'll see a lot of these catches happening within the first hour of the morning and uh, we had six keepers in the first hour to hour and a half. Yeah, he's 15 and a half. All right. There he goes for it. There's a couple right here. Those are good ones though. Good? I don't know, it feels good. Like I fucking watched him eat it. Oh yeah, he's good. Here he comes. Yeah! So this one here was a good fish that we definitely needed and uh, after that catching this one we decided to go fish a little bit along the shoreline there to give this little spot a, a, re a rest and then we were going to come back. Measure him, but he's fat. Yep. Yeah, he's over 16. There was more than him. A lot of these times you tell me just keep having him measure him because in October the fish size limit changes to 15 inches. So it's just wanting to right make sure gun. that they're over 15 when a lot of these were like way over 15. There'd be a keeper in the summer. Mm-hmm. He was out, out. Even up here against shore, it was the same. The fish were sitting like right at the drop off, so just about out in six foot, I would say. Way out here. Oh, crap. Check. 
just a check. Please <laughs> check. That's not crash. Good one? This is about where I caught that stuff. Yeah, he's a good one. I think he's a good one. Oh, he's a good one. Yeah, it's a nice net. Nice one. Nice one. Nice one. Nice one. Pulled it right out, right out of that grass, and wham! After this fish, it kind of became slightly a grind. We did upgrade a couple more times and call out a couple more fish, as you'll see here. Um, but it did really slow down. I, I mean, the bites were really fast there in the morning, but through the rest of the day, it was just a grind. Just one bite here, one bite there. And we just kept going and just trying to upgrade where we could. There's a dandy. Take your time. Well, I should say it's my first fish of the day, so it might not be a dandy. Put the other big one on that side. Yeah. That's a almost a tree. After this catch, the camera turned off and I didn't catch it. But we caught a total, I think, of ten, eight to ten keepers or something like that, and a couple smaller ones. And once again, I want to thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time. Eagle.